Hello! Time to show you another program tutorial. Um, today I'm going to sh be showing you a video game that I created. Um, it's a text-based video game. No, there's no GUI in it. Um, I'll just show you it. Basically, it's sort of like um, Minesweeper. Just like it's not. Um, so here it is. Um, I'm not going to go through all the game crap, I'm just going to, like, I'll show you the game, then I'll try and um, explain it. So, um, I'll go through the program, you know. So, yeah, import, um, drawing the board, um, printing numbers, use coordinates. Uh, basically, what you do is, um, you have to find um, treasures um, on, like, a seabed. Um, sorry, on the grid I mean, and um, use coordinates to find them, and if you're near the um, treasure it will tell you, you know, how many spaces you are, and um, if you do actually get on it using the coordinates then um, you win, well, you get a point anyway. Um, so yeah, basically what it does, it's a very big program, um, it took me ages to make. Oh, when I say made, my um, teacher gave me a sheet and then I had to, um, you know, copy it out. Um, but yeah, I had a few white space errors and it took ages just to, you know, debug it. Um, so yeah, it's pr yeah, pretty big program. Um, most of it's, you know, drawing it, um, on if statements. Yeah, that's a bit weird, it shows the instructions. Um, I'll just get straight on it. So press. So here we go. Do you want to view instructions? Oh, yes. Okay. You are the captain of the Simon, a treasure hunting ship. Your current mission is to find the three sunken treasure chests that are lurking in the part of the ocean you are in and collect them. To play, enter the coordinates of the point in the ocean you wish to drop a sonar device. The sonar can find out how far away the closest chest is to it. For example, the D below marks where the device was dropped, and the twos represent distances two away from the device, and four represents the distance far away from the device. So, yeah, you still get it. Um, it looks pretty complicated, but you know, once you start playing, um, it's pretty easy to um, understand. So let's give you an example. So, for example, here's a treasure chest, um, the C. Locate the distance of two way from the sun device D. So yeah, here's D and here's the um, treasure chest, and it's two away. The point where the device was dropped will be matched with a two. Okay, I'm not going to go through all that. So here's the board here. Um, so what you do is you type in your coordinates to um, find to the treasure chest. So, um, we'll go for a random one, um, we'll go for 8, and then we'll go for 31. Oh, I didn't really hear it, um, actually shows you, so, you can have, not 59, not 14. Okay, so um, I don't know, 20, oops, 20, I just said 20, oh it's to 14, sorry, okay. oh. so here we are, um, the treasure is detected a distance of 4 from the sun device, you have 15 sun devices left, okay, so um, Far away. So here it is. So let's see the far across, far there, far up there. Hmm. Okay. Um. I will try. Two, three, four. Fifteen. Fourteen.
six away. Um, it's pretty. It's pretty hard to um, find it. Means a pretty big grid. Um, four away. So I'm guessing it's going to be back here then. Um, so we'll try one, two, three, four, twenty-four, fourteen. Hmm. Let's try it then. One, two, three, four. So that'll be ten. I'm oh, sorry now. Um, what's that? Twenty. Ten. Oh, one away. Okay, um, oh, I guess it can go in like four different directions, can it? We'll try one up, so that would be 29. Right, let's try, um, we'll try here, um, 19. Ten. So it's got to be here then. Um, Twenty-one. Twenty-two. Twenty-three. Twenty-four. Twenty-five. Yes, I found a sunken treasure chest. So there you go, found one. Um, yes, yeah, so you get it. I'm not going to go through it all because it's going to take ages. But um, it's a pretty um, interesting game. Um, I won't say it's very fun. Um, but it's interesting, and um, certainly when doing programming, um, it's pretty nice. Um, so yeah, if you want this game, um, I'm going to make a code repository on my um, Quantum website, um, which you can, you know, just copy and then you can copy and paste it into, um, you know, your Python ID, and you know, play it to your heart's content. So um, my next video will probably be another program tutorial. Not sure what I'm going to be doing. Um, I tried to do the Hello World Pie game um, thing, but <laughs> I, d I can't. F um, I can't find where the problem is. It's probably just some daft white space error or something. Um, but I'll see if I can fix it. Um, so I'll see you for the next video.